Creating content and having a strong online presence can really help to grow your business and connect with your audience, but if you're not doing it right, then it can actually hurt your brand. So when trying to figure out what is going to be a good piece of content, like what criteria do you look out for? First and foremost, you need to do some research and try to figure out what is your audience actually looking for. And if you have no idea, start to think like your audience and figure out what other videos are out there. If that content doesn't have a lot of engagement, that might be a trigger to you that it's actually not that great of an idea and you don't want to spend time on it. So if you already have some content that you've created and your audience has responded really well to it, maybe create similar content because that's already your key that they like that stuff. When I'm coming up with my own content ideas, there's a certain process that I follow. So the first step is I will just do a complete brain dump, whatever comes to my mind and it could come up when I'm like showering or making dinner or something. I always write down every idea I have, good or bad. I don't roll it out from the very beginning. I'll come back to it later. Then I like to do my research. So have other people created content similar to that. What content is out there and what new can I add to the space? And then from there, it's really just like honing in on my idea, seeing if I've created any similar piece of content before, how well has it performed? If it hasn't performed really well, then maybe I can shift it and make it into something new and really exciting for my audience. And my audience has grown so much over the past few years that I'm really lucky that I have an audience base that I can throw ideas at and they can respond back to me. If you are a small business and you don't have that as an option, always take a look at similar businesses or maybe even if you have a small audience, ask them what they would wanna see from you because that is extremely helpful. One big mistake that I notice a lot of small businesses make when it comes to content creation is that they get started and they're really excited and maybe they come up with like three pieces of content and then they drop it because there's so much other work that needs to get done. One of the problems to being inconsistent is of course the algorithm. The algorithm really rewards people that continue to make content because if you're keeping people coming back to the platform, they're going to reward you for it. They're gonna suggest your content. They're gonna push it out more than others, but also for your audience. If they're trying to find you on Instagram, if they're trying to find you on YouTube and they realize that you've only posted a couple of things, that inconsistency is not going to build good credibility for you and your business. And you want to make sure that you're providing your audience with what they are looking for from you. So being consistent, is just an absolute must. If you're a little scared to get started and just like a little worried about entering the online space, you really just have to get started. Just know that it's gonna help your brand in the long run. And also everyone starts from the beginning. All of us start at zero. So if you're worried right now that you're not gonna create the best content, just grow and evolve as you continue to create that content. Really look into your analytics and listen to your audience. What do they like to see from you? Maybe what don't they like to see from you? And just continue to evolve from there. You're going to make mistakes. And as a business owner, you probably already know that and you just have to run with it the mistakes are how you're going to be able to grow so really just get started right now <laughs>